Researchers with the United States Department of Agriculture have found that Michigan has the highest percentage of deer carrying antibodies of the virus that causes COVID-19. 13 on your side's Brent Ashcroft joins us now with details. Brent. Julie at the USDA says it's analyzed blood samples from more than 600 deer from four states, Michigan, Illinois, New York and Pennsylvania. 67% of the deer tested from Michigan were found to have the antibodies that cause coronavirus. Big question, is it transferable to humans? We see them lurking. Try not to hit them. SARS-CoV-2 is the virus that causes COVID-19. But should we be avoiding them entirely? We really don't have any idea how deer are exposed to the virus. Researchers with the USDA say the risk of animals, including deer, spreading COVID-19 to people is low. A recent study conducted by the USDA between January 2020 and March 2021 indicates an uncomfortably crooked number. There were 113 of those samples. 67% of those were positive for antibodies. But because those samples was a small sample size, only 113 um, samples, and they were not collected in a way that, that um, was systematic throughout the state, um, we're on, we're, we can't extrapolate that 67% number to all the deer. Researchers believe that it's possible deer were exposed through people, the environment, or even other animal species. Currently, there is no evidence that animals play a significant role at all in spreading SARS-CoV-2. There is also no evidence that you can get COVID-19 by eating food, including wild game, hunted game meat. Since there's no evidence showing that COVID-19 is transmissible from deer to humans, researchers still recommend to enjoy wildlife from a distance. Brent Ashcroft, 13 on your side. Currently, USDA is working with the state wildlife agencies and other federal and state partners to determine what are the next steps. Researchers will continue to expand their surveillance of wildlife to determine if the COVID-19 virus is free ranging in just deer or if it's also present in predators that eat deer. Guys. Thanks, Brent.